Hello, Red Devils fans, and welcome back to another exciting update from our beloved Manchester United Football Club. It's been quite the journey, hasn't it? But finally, there's a sense of optimism brewing at Old Trafford under the leadership of Eric Ten Hogg and with Sir Jim Ratcliffe's influence. The club seems to be finding its stride once again. The team's performance on the pitch has been commendable lately, with Ten Hogg's tactics breathing new life into our style of play. And let's not forget the positive impact of having a stable environment off the field. With fewer distractions, the players can focus on what they do best, winning matches. This weekend, we face Aston Villa in what promises to be a challenging fixture. However, it's also an opportunity for us to prove that we belong among the top contenders for a spot in the top four. Unfortunately, there's a bit of concerning news on the injury front. Aaron W. A. Mbisaka, a key player in our defensive setup, seems to have encountered a setback in his recovery. According to the gaffer, he had to drop out of training, and the severity of his condition remains uncertain at this time. Before we continue, if you're enjoying this update and want to stay informed about all things Manchester United, make sure to subscribe to our channel, hit that notification bell, and give this video a thumbs up. Your support means everything to us. Losing W.A. Mbisaka, even if only temporarily, is undoubtedly a blow to the team. His unique defensive abilities would have been invaluable, especially in a fixture like the upcoming one against Villa. Let's keep our fingers crossed that his injury isn't too serious and that he'll be back on the pitch sooner rather than later. Do you think Aaron is a good player? I believe he is, but he still needs to improve a lot. Do you agree with me or not? Leave your opinion in the comments below. As always, your thoughts and comments are highly appreciated. Share your predictions and opinions down below. Thanks for tuning in, and until next time, glory, glory Manchester United.